Hi, friends. It's me, Nova. Today, we're going to learn all about the most important star in our solar system, the sun. You see the sun shining up in the sky every day, but did you know it's much more amazing than it looks? Let me take you on a fun journey to learn all about this giant ball of fire. The sun is huge, bigger than you can imagine. If you could take 1.3 million Earths, yes, 1.3 million, you could fit them inside the sun. It's so big and powerful that it holds all the planets in place with its strong gravity, making sure we keep spinning around it. That's why Earth, along with all the other planets, like Mercury and Venus, never float away. The sun is like the big boss of the solar system, keeping everyone in line. But what is the sun made of? Well, it's not made of solid stuff like Earth. It's actually a giant, glowing ball of hot gas. It's made mostly of two gases, hydrogen and helium. And these gases are constantly burning, which makes the sun super hot. The surface of the sun is around 10,000 degrees Fahrenheit. That's hotter than anything on Earth, even volcanoes. But guess what? That's nothing compared to the core, or the center, of the sun, where the temperature can reach a mind-blowing 27 million degrees Fahrenheit. Can you imagine how hot that is? Now, here's something cool. Did you know that the sun is really a giant energy factory? Inside the sun, something amazing happens called nuclear fusion. That's when hydrogen atoms smash together to form helium, and this releases a huge amount of energy. This energy travels all the way from the core of the sun to Earth, and that's what gives us light and heat. Every time you feel the warmth of the sun on your skin, you're feeling energy that traveled millions of miles to reach you. Speaking of distance, the sun is 93 million miles away from Earth. That's so far that it takes about 8 minutes for the light from the sun to reach us. So, when you see the sunlight, you're actually looking at light that left the sun 8 minutes ago. Isn't that wild? But the sun isn't always calm. It has some pretty wild things happening on its surface. Sometimes, it has something called solar flares. These are huge explosions of energy that shoot out into space. And sometimes the sun has sunspots. These are darker, cooler spots on the sun's surface. They're still really hot, but just a little cooler than the rest of the sun scientists watch these sunspots to learn more about the sun's activity. Now, let me tell you something super exciting. The sun isn't just sitting still in space. Oh no, it's spinning, too. But here's the interesting part. Different parts of the sun spin at different speeds. The equator, or the middle part of the sun, spins faster than the poles, or the top and bottom. It takes about 25 days for the sun to make one full spin at the equator, and about 35 days at the poles. Isn't that cool? It's like the sun is doing a slow motion dance in space. Even though the sun is super important, it won't last forever. Right now, the sun is in the middle of its life and has been shining for about 4.6 billion years. But in another 5 billion years, the sun will run out of fuel. When that happens, it will grow into something called a red giant, which means it will get so big that it might swallow some of the inner planets, like Mercury and Venus. Don't worry, though, it won't happen for a very, very long time. After that, the sun will shrink down and become a white dwarf, which is a small, cooler star. But right now, the sun is still burning bright, and we can enjoy all the amazing things it does for us. Without the sun, Earth would be dark, cold, and lifeless. Plants wouldn't grow, and we wouldn't have food to eat or air to breathe. The sun is like the Earth's life-giving friend, always shining down to help everything grow and keep us warm. 
So, to sum it up, the sun is a giant, fiery star at the center of our solar system. It's super big, super hot, and super important. It keeps the planets in place, gives us light and warmth, and helps plants grow. And even though it's millions of miles away, its energy reaches us every day. Thanks for learning all about the sun with me. I hope you had fun on this space adventure. Remember to keep looking up at the sky and imagining all the incredible things happening up there. Until next time, friends. Bye. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this story, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you'd like to hear more fun and exciting stories, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss an upload. Also, feel free to share this video with your friends and family who might love story time as much as you do. See you in the next one.